Previously on Speed Racer. I could swear sometimes that virtual track is out to get me. I told you I wanted to be rid of speed. Well, let's see how he likes this. The course was altered today and using Zyle Zazik's code. Speed, you better get out of... Three objects just got sucked into the virtual track. Speed! Speed, are you there? Speed! Speed, can you hear me? I can't get through to him. And we've got one more hour until the Zazek Industries technicians start dismantling the track systems. Once they do that, Speed will be stranded forever. We'll come up with something and get him out of the virtual track. We just need more time. Thanks, Chim Chim, but this is no time for corny jokes. I said this wasn't the time. And don't hand me another watch. Connor, I think we need to call X. He should be in his room. Talk to me. X, it's Lucy. What did Speed do now? Oh, he kind of got stuck in the virtual track. What? We can't get him out, and if they shut it down while he's in there, he'll be lost forever. Where are you? The track control room with Connor. We're trying to figure something out. I'll be right there. In the meantime, keep Connor working. Thanks, X. He said he'll be right over. Good. We might need a little muscle over here. Not that Chim Chim and I aren't ripped. <laughs> I programmed the track to simulate the school's campus, so Speed should feel at home. Still, it must be horrible to be stuck in there. Are you done yet, lame boy? Can we get out of here already? Don't you think I would have gotten us out of here already if I could? I try not to think about you at all. I can't believe I'm stuck in this stupid track with you. Come on. I know you're generally an unpleasant person, but this is kind of fun. We can do anything we want with the Mach 6. No race, no rules. And if we mess up the school, who cares? It's fake. I don't care. I just want out of here. Fine, you're right. We should find a way out of here. Right after I jump the library. <laughs> No good. I still have no idea how to get speed free. The techs are gonna be here any minute. We've gotta do something. It's them, it's them. What are we gonna do? Hide! Will you two knock it off? It's just X. Where are we at? We still haven't been able to contact Speed, and the tech guys are gonna be here any second. Well, we're gonna have to get them out of here somehow. Tell them the room's flooded. No, on fire. Flooded and on fire. I have a better idea. Uh, hello. Uh, Mr. Zazek wanted me to tell you guys to go home and take the day off. His orders. What? Nobody told us anything about a day off. What's going on in there? Why is this door locked? Uh, uh... What's going on out there? Don't you people know I'm busy cleaning up the flood in here? No, I mean... <laughs> I have a lot of money, and, and I, like I like to buy things. things. I, I like, like to buy a zebra. zebra. Uh, I... Uh, hey, give me... Look, I don't have time to chit-chat with my employees. Now go home and don't come back until I call. Uh, yes, Mr. Sasek. Right away. <laughs> oh, man. You almost blew that. No, I didn't. I can't believe that worked. Nice going, X. X? What about me? You get back to the controls. We may not know how to free speed, but at least now we've got plenty of time to figure it out. Well, how's the track overhaul come? What's going on here? I'm hungry. Where's my breakfast? Stan! Oops! Sorry, Mr. Z. Stan, you fool. All my plans for world domination were on this desk, and now they're covered in egg. I can clean them. Stan, stop eating my plans. Will you just get my daughter on the line? Hey, this is Annalise. Leave a message, and if I think you're cool enough, I'll call you back. Do you think I'm cool enough for her to call back? No. What about now? Will you just leave a message for her to call me? Are you sure about this? Yes, I'm sure. If we blaze through the exit rings at a high enough speed, we'll totally be able to blast our way out of the virtual world. I don't know. I really don't think this is going to work. Will you just do it already? I'm tired of being stuck here. Really? I would have never known. Here goes something! Hey, Annalise! 
police. Don't say it. Fine, I won't say I told you so. Ugh, you're such a dork. <laughs> Look, let's check out the virtual Connor's garage. If it's anything like his real garage, it should be filled with energy disruptors and couplings. You might be able to use that stuff to get us out of here. Fine, let's go check out the nerd stuff. And then Speed and the Mach 6 were pulled into the virtual track, and we've been trying to get them out ever since. I can't believe what I'm hearing. This is the most irresponsible thing I've ever heard of. Once this is over, you're all on detention until you graduate. Hey, I just got here. Save the detention for the other three. This is bad. Very bad. What is it? The virtual world is beginning to break down. This might be a good thing. If the virtual world totally dissolves, maybe it'll spit out speed in the process. No, it won't. If the virtual world disappears, so will speed. Might as well do some spying while I'm here. Sorry for the unscheduled pit stop. This world might be fake, but my blood are... Ew, I get it. So, uh, tell me about the Mach 6. What about it? How powerful is the engine? What's its top speed? What do all these buttons do? Uh, that's classified. I can't tell you. But I can show you. <laughs> What happened to the ground? Come on, baby! We're not gonna make it! That was too close. What was that hole? I don't know. It looked like... Well, it looked like nothing. Like a void in the virtual world. It seems like the virtual world is deleting itself. What? How can you tell? Well, I think that hole is still growing. We're never getting out of here, and I blame you. I haven't heard you come up with any brilliant ideas. Here's a great idea. I'm never going to get anywhere near you again. That is a great idea. Ugh. Annalise, wait. We need to stick together. Annalise, wait. Annalise. Connor, do you have any idea why the virtual world is eating itself? No, sir, I can't figure it out. There are just too many lines of code to go over. I'm never gonna figure it out. Speed's gonna be trapped forever. He's gonna be so mad at me. I gotta, I gotta, I, I, Take it I, easy, Connor. Just calm down. Imagine your happy place. My happy place. Happy place. More lemonade, darling. No, thank you, dear. What about you, honey? Connor, are you okay? Oh, yeah, I'm okay. Just lost it for a sec. So you were saying there are too many lines of computer code for you to check. Is there anything we can do to help? Not really. I just wish there was a way I could see all that code working as a whole. Then I could find the problem. Wait a second. I have an idea. Jim Jim, get over here and link it to the main computer. This is so cool. Huh? Oh, that's not it. I know they're in here somewhere. I mean, where else would I have put them? I always put the virtual reality goggles back in Chim Chim. Aha! I'm gonna jack directly into the virtual track program. From there, I'll be able to find whatever is causing the track malfunction. While you do that, X, Lucy, and I will try to establish contact with speed. Perfect. Time to go virtual. Chim Chim, now! This is so cool. <laughs> This is ridiculous. I can get kings and vicious dictators on the phone, but I can't get a hold of my own daughter. She's doing this on purpose. Well, she can just forget that little island I was going to buy her. You already bought her like four of them. We'll sell them all. Can I have one? No! Goodbye, Stanopolis. Aha! Found it! If I can just attach his power coupling to the Mach 6's laser saws, maybe I can use them to disrupt the virtual track field enough to get out of here. Why am I talking to myself? Whatever. This better work or Annalise and I are goners. I hope she's okay. Come on, you stupid hunk of junk! My father built you, stupid track! Let me out of here or I'll have my dad melt you down! The Void. He's gonna eat me! What do you think Connor's seeing in there? Who knows, but I bet it's weird. We look awesome! Nice and beefy! 
Trust me, plus we got sweet stashes. Chip Chip, we've got to find the computer code that's crashing the virtual track and fast. Look over there. You don't build a protection program like that without something to hide. Let's go tear down that wall. Grab a hold, Chim Chim, and pull like it's tug of war time. Harder, Chim Chim, harder. Just a little more. Uh, I think I pulled my virtual back. Oh, I think that's what we're looking for, Chim Chim. It's some kind of virus. I think we made it cranky. Oh, my virtual ribs. This thing hugs like my aunt. We've got to get out of here. Oh. Connor, are you okay? Fine, just a brain-splitting headache. What did you find out? There's a virus in the system, and it's eating all the other programs. That's why the virtual world is disappearing. But what are we going to do about it? Nothing. There's no way to delete it, but on the bright side, once it's through eating everything else, it'll eat itself and be purged from the system. But if it eats everything else, then Speed is a goner. Well, I didn't say it was a really bright side. We've got to contact Speed now and let him know all this. Lucy, how is the rewiring going? Just one more bypass to go, sir. Try it now. I think that did it. I'm going to try and home in on the mock steps. This better work. <laughs> Not bad. But will they get me out of here? We did it! Speed, can you hear us? We're still not getting audio. Uh-oh. Guys, check out behind Speed. Speed, behind you! Look, Speed, look! Guys, I, I can't hear you. What is it? What are they trying to say? Help! 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 Oh, no. Annalise must be out there. gonna try to hug me, are you? Ew, no! What is Annalise doing in there with Speed? With Speed? She's not with Speed. He knows I love her. What Connor's trying to say, sir, is that we have no idea how she got in there. I don't suppose it matters right now. We still need to find a way to boost the comm signal so we can talk to them. Bird! What? Bird! If Speed activates the Mach 6 homing bird, we can use it to amplify our signal. We've gotta let Speed know somehow. I got it. Do what I do. What are they doing? Being nerds. Thanks. Come on, they're they're flapping their arms. What does that mean? I don't know, but they look like lame birds. That's it. The car's holding bird. They want me to launch. <laughs> It worked! Listen, Speed, some kind of virus is eating the virtual track program. If we can't stop it, well, uh... What she's trying to say is that if we don't stop this virus, you two will be trapped in there forever. Well, get us out of here, then. We're trying. Try harder. Guys, I have an idea. If the virus is eating the track, just give it more to eat. What do you mean? Just to add new track elements to the program. That should keep the virus busy while we figure a way out of here. Great idea. I'll get right on it. Annalise, I'm going to have to contact your father and let him know your situation. Man, I wouldn't want to be you. I know, but we could use his help. He did help design this facility. This is ridiculous. Where is that girl? Stan, get Headmaster Spritel on the phone. Maybe he can find her. You got it, boss. 
Hello? 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 Headmaster? Listen, Sile, I have some disturbing news. Your daughter has somehow gotten trapped inside the virtual track with speed. What? How could this happen? We don't know. There's some kind of virus disrupting the systems. We need your help. Can you give me a moment, Headmaster? I can't believe this. If I do nothing, Speed and the Mach 6 will be gone forever. My oil company could pump on safely. All I need to do is sacrifice my daughter. What to do? Daughter, oil company, limitless power, limitless hugs, unimaginable wealth, the unconditional love of a child. I do so enjoy money. No, I can't do it. I can't sacrifice my daughter. We'll be right there, Headmaster. So enjoy the scenery while you can. Quickly, give me an update. Connor has been filling the track computers as fast as he can, but the virus continues to expand. Also, the Mach 6 is running out of gas. Ironic. Why? Oh, nothing. This is my new head track technician. He has something he thinks may help. I brought an experimental energy amplifier with me. It should boost the track's power enough to form a portal for Annalise and Speed to escape through. Sounds good. What do you need us to do? I need you to run up to the track exit portal and attach the amplifier to its power system. You guys better hurry. The virus is speeding up. You better input stuff faster, Connor. The void thing is getting way too close. My fingers can't go any faster. It's the virus program. It keeps accelerating. Wait, can you use the historical speed eraser files we saw in class? Great idea. I'll just dump them all into the memory core. There. Awesome job, Connor. Speed, behind us, look! Connor, what are those things? Oh, no! I must have accidentally loaded the Speed Racer enemy files along with the track! You what? I was only doing what you told me! Well, who are they? The Mammoth Car and the X3? Those guys almost smashed my father to pieces! Look, don't worry. I'm sure they're not really programmed to attack. Maybe not. Okay, I've attached it to the ring. Now what? Turn it on, my boy. Race, these guys are trying to smash us. 
do you suggest I get these guys off me? Let them get closer, then hit the turbos and catch them in the jet wash. Now! <laughs> Speed, I need you to go left at the next fork. The exit portal should be open on your side and waiting. Awesome. Thank you, sir. Crash that car if you want to thank me. What? No, nothing. Good luck. There it is! We made it! What was that? We're out of gas. 